Hello, Internet. So I've been thinking a lot about documentation lately. This is a YouTube channel, and there's something inherently self-aware about this medium. You know, like I'm sitting here in this video talking to you about this video. And that happens a lot. Social media encourages this kind of writing about writing. And this often comes off as egocentric, you know, self-absorbed people obsessively taking pictures of their breakfast, and there can be elements of that. But I'd like to suggest that it also suggests a kind of consciousness, self-awareness. The job of a professional YouTuber is a very funny thing. They're kind of professional self-documenters, which is <laughs> A funny profession to have when you think about it that way. So I'm gonna take this self-documenting space here to to sort of ponder a bit on, on what that means. So there used to be this website called Olife. Olife was this service that would send you an email once a day that said, it's April 20th, what did you do today? And then you would respond to the email, however you wanted to respond with gibberish or with what you did, and that was it. Olife would send you an email every day, and you'd respond back what you did that day. And then, after a while, once it had enough backlog of days, it would send them back to you. So the email you would get would be, it's April 21st, what did you do today? Last year, you wrote this. So I have a close friend named Dana. We wrote a book together, see? This is our book. Here we are. Me and Dana, in a book. It's pretty cool. So I met Dana about four years ago, right around the same time that I started using Olife. One day she saw me writing down my day and she asked me what I was doing and it started a, a funny kind of relationship. Pretty soon, every evening, I would send her a message saying, it's April 22nd, what did you do today? And she would respond telling me the boring contents of her day and then I would tell her the boring contents of mine. We became the guardians of each other's days, bearers of each other's memories. Now, most of the memories are pretty boring. You know, it's just what I did today. Most of life is pretty boring. Any day out of the series taken out random will probably be pretty uninteresting, but I've got four years of them. And looking back over that length of time, there's some kind of incredible narrative that unfolds, or at least an incredible narrative that could be gleaned from it. You know, however much I want to mythologize my life, which apparently is a lot because I'm talking to you on the screen. Now basically what I've described to you is, is journaling, a diary, and people have been keeping diaries for hundreds of years, thousands of years. But something very interesting happens when a diary becomes public. But not only public, but easily accessible and searchable and engageable with interactable. Right? So I'm documenting myself for you here. I document myself to Dana every day in a more, slightly more private way than this big stage YouTube, but, but still, documenting myself for someone else, a person I know or people I don't know, but also documenting myself for myself. When I'm 85, I'll be able to look back on a series of days thousands and thousands of days, or a series of videos, maybe thousands of videos, you know, of slow and steady progression of the life of a human being, captured digitally, virtually, forever. I'm not really sure what to make of it. It's kind of scary, but I think it's also really important. All right, I have a confession people of YouTube. This video actually isn't for you. I thought it was for you when I started making it, but I, 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 was, I was lying to myself. This video is actually for Dana. It's public, you can see it, but it's also private. It's a weird public, private, it's, it's, it's all blendy, mergy here. Yeah, this video is for Dana because, because Miss Day, I have been sharing my day with you for the last four years. Minus a few gaps here and there. Four years. Like, <laughs> that's really special. That's really special. So, thank you for being the keeper of my days. And I guess for you other YouTube people, also thank you for being the keeper of my days. This is what I did today. I made a vlog. It's what I think. So thanks. Bye.